What's up guys, Trev and Chelsea here. Today we are bringing you guys another Pokemon Go video and this one's gonna be kind of interesting. This is almost like an experiment. So uh, I've seen tons of stuff on Twitter and on Reddit and all kinds of stuff like that talking about what happens if you drop an incense and find Pokemon in a place that hasn't really been charted or mapped by Pokemon Go. So something with no Pokestops, no gyms, no anything nearby, no spawn points for Pokemon, what are you going to get? A lot of people say you'll get super rare and random stuff. Well, we figured what better place to test this than out in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean down here in the Caribbean. So we're here on a cruise ship. You guys can see. Look at that. I just got a, I just got a little squirtle. So that's diglet. pretty cool. You got a diglet? In the ocean. Look at this right here. We have a squirtle on our balcony. Isn't that really cool? He's a 64, so he's not a very high CP, but still. Anyway, yeah. Out here, guys, there is no land for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of miles. This is our last day on the cruise. We are headed back to Florida right now, but uh, there hasn't been anything close to us in a very, very long distance. So we're going to see what kind of Pokemon we get. We're going to report back to you guys and let you know how it goes. All right, guys, so uh, and now I'm going to go through a slideshow of screenshots of all the Pokemon that we saw, and it was absolutely insane. We were on the cruise, we were trying to enjoy the cruise, so we only ended up doing two instances, but you guys going to see it's crazy. I mean, Arbok was out there, Ponyta, Dugtrio. Why would a Dugtrio be in the middle of the ocean? It was absolutely insane. Dratinis, Dragonairs, all kinds of crazy stuff. It was seriously crazy, and it's all because we were off the map, according to the Niantic Pokemon map. So this is 100% confirmed. Both Chelsea and I have received these results and it's kind of consistent with some of the results of other people I've seen posting online. So if you guys ever have the chance to go somewhere either really, really remote, like out in the country, nowhere near a city or any sort of landmark, or even better is out in the water, whether you're going on a cruise or deep sea fishing or anything like that. If you guys have the chance, bring your phone and drop incenses because you are going to get crazy different types of rare Pokemon and it's really, really useful. So there you guys have it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. We really wish we could have brought you guys Pokemon Go videos from the different islands that we visited, like, you know, the Haiti, Jamaica, Cozumel, stuff like that. And uh, I was supposed to have a data plan from Verizon to be able to connect the phones to, to be able to play and record it and stuff like that. But it didn't end up working out. There was a problem with it. So we couldn't get it figured out. But uh, that's all right. We're back home now. We're very excited to get back to recording Pokemon Go videos for you guys. I know there have been a lack of Pokemon Go videos on this channel for the past like week, week and a half. But that's because we were on the cruise and then Hurricane Matthew came through. So now all of that's done. We're going to get right back into posting daily or every other day videos on Pokemon Go. And hope you guys are very excited for that. So we're going to catch you guys later. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out.